hi everyone and welcome back and i'm going to publish a couple of videos maybe more than that which will talk about how to write a clean code for javascript i mean in daily basis we are writing node.js react angular vanilla javascript but sometimes we encounter uh, issues okay this is not a clean code this is not unit testable code i think i can do some better in this particular code and when the when you raise a pr you get a review feedbacks all these things so we will just try to see what all common mistakes a developer will always do and i will be just talking about this based on my experience in development like what all common mistakes we always do while writing the code we, we are not saying i'm not saying that that's a mistake or your program will not work our code will not work it, it's just that we should write a clean code more structured by following some principle so that when your code is being reviewed it always i mean whoever is reading your code feels good after looking at the structure of your code okay so this is just a particular course and i may be posting some videos around it what we are going to talk about in couple of videos is the naming conventions and how to write functions and using the functional programming to make your things make your code look more functional okay we'll talk about different modules module pattern in javascript which actually gives a proper structure to your application or your code we'll talk about the design pattern design pattern and module pattern are different module pattern are something which related to the javascript some design pattern which are global which are common in most of the programming language then we will see how we can use this solid principle in while writing the code and we will write the unit testable code we will write small functions you not know, taking a huge set of arguments in it like one or two arguments in a function so we will try to split the logic into a different different functions so that your code will be unit testable and then finally we will do some code reviews we will just try to find out the code smell we will just see a chunk of code and we will try to optimize it based on whatever we learned through these couple of videos okay this is all we have so so let's get started